In this topic, we are going to learn about turning points or also known as stationary points. Turning points, they are points on the curve where the y dx is zero. Let us look at the first curve. This is a minimum. This curve has a minimum point. Okay. Now, A is a point on the curve. As A moves from left to right, left to right, right? A moves from left to right. The value of X increases and you can look at the gradient of tangent at the point A. Now it is one negative 1.9. As A moves from left to right, the value of gradient will become less and less negative and at one point it will become zero. Then, after turning the point, after the turning point, the gradient becomes positive. Now let us look at this graph B. Right. B is a point on the graph. This is this graph has a maximum point. As the point B moves from left to right, look at how the gradient of tension at B changes. Okay, one more time. Huh? As the value of X increases or as B moves from left to right, the value of gradient is positive and it is becoming less and less positive. At one point, the gradient is zero. And that is the turning point. After the turning point, the gradient becomes more and more negative. Okay, right. Now let us look at the graph C. C is a point on this graph. Now if you look at the gradient of tangent at the point C, as C moves from left to right, the gradient of tangent is positive and it approaches zero, finally becomes zero and it becomes positive again. Okay. Now at the point where the gradient dy dx is zero, okay. Okay, at the point where dy dx is zero or the gradient is zero, this point is neither minimum nor maximum. It is called the point of inflection. 